Hey guys, it's Joe at Lucas. I hope you're having a great Thursday. Tasting counters open at three o'clock. I wanna share with you what we got on it. We got our 90 plus. We got some great beers, one that I really love. I love stouts, I like porters, I like deep beers that I stick a fork up in the glass and they hang out. But I really wanna focus on the spirits we have today. This is Roger Klein and the Peacemakers. This is his tequila. It's a great tequila. If you know me, you know I love tequila. I think it's an amazing spirit. But let's go through these and then we're gonna talk about some, some local vodka and gin. That's very inexpensive, that's fantastic. So we're gonna go through all these. Let's start with the Blanco. Now when you, I, I, tequila is so different because you got lowlands and you got highlands. This is more of a highlands, so it's gonna be sweeter. A lowlands gonna be more earthy. Melon, citrus, little white pepper. This is really nice tequila. And if you're a fan of Roger Klein, you gotta come in and taste it. So that's, that's a Blanco. Let's go to the Reposado. The Reposado is aged for nine months, so a little longer than most of the Reposados on the shelf. Most of them are around four to six months. The minute you smell this, I get like agave and honey. That's what I get on the nose. That's just, it's a super great uh, Reposado. Right at the end, you get a blast of honey. This is super good, I love that. This one's $43.99. All right, let's move on to the Anejo. Now this one, again, they age your stuff just a little bit longer. This is rested for 18 months. And right when you put your nose in, you smell agave and vanilla. You get a lot of vanilla, so we know it's American oak that it's aged on. I want to back up. It's aged in bourbon barrels. It's a little American oak, but you pick a little smokiness up from that. Yep, I was just double checking it. A little tobacco, vanilla. These are great tequilas. Great tequilas. Come in and try them out. This one, the Anejo's $51.99. Okay. God, I love tequila. Okay, let's go on to the Baca and the Gin. Local distiller in Elizabeth. Inexpensive. What I like about the vodka, this vodka, when you smell it, it's really light on alcohol. It almost smells like water. And when you taste it, it's super clean. That's what we want with drinking vodka. This will make a great martini. So you don't have to mix this one. It just leaves nothing there. It's sweet, very nice, corn based, very inexpensive, under $15. That's a great bottle of vodka. The gin, I cheated a little bit, I had some before the film. Okay, the gin, when you smell it, you get orange and citrus right on the nose. The minute you put your nose in the glass, it's gonna come up, so we know it's a New World gin. Tons of citrus flavor, very light on the juniper, but a super good gin, easy to drink, go nice and like in a gin and tonic, and that also is $14.98. Hey, Three o'clock start tasting. Come in and try these spirits. Love tequila, I wanna share it with you. Ask for me, look forward to seeing you. Truly appreciate your business, one bottle at a time. Thanks for shopping at Lucas, have an awesome weekend.